guys i'm i'm live on uh youtube so i hate call tools hate it with a passion Hello. Are, hello. Hello. Yes, sir. Are you interested in renting an apartment from us in Comanche, Texas? I, uh, where Where is Comanche, Texas? Sorry, it's, I've been looking for for places. I'm in DFW. How far away are you? Oh, we're we're pretty good distance away from DFW. Okay. Yeah, probably not. Okay. What about uh Fort Worth? What? What about Fort Worth? Um, were you one of the ones that I tried to get a hold of on Facebook? most likely okay um i will get back to facebook after the beginning of the next month for this stuff my 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 littlest one uh he's got he's high risk for COVID, so that's that's the the reason that i'm having to look for a place they're pushing this out anyway, so. oh man i hate that there ain't no rona in uh, comanche though no yeah. no rona at all yes okay uh i'll save this number and then i'll I'll call you back at the beginning of next month. So. Awesome, man. Appreciate it. Thank you. Hello? 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 Can you hear me? Hello. Hello. Yes, sir. Are you looking to rent an apartment from 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 us in Comanche? Uh, no, I'm not in Comanche. I'm in uh, Laguna Park. I was, I was looking at a place in Hamilton, but y'all said they don't allow pets. What kind of pet? Uh, it's a dog. What kind of dog? Uh, she's a mutt. She's uh, I think she's got some uh, pet in her, but she's got on just a mutt. Oh well, that's why the it's the it's the pit bull that's not allowed. It's not the pets. Yeah, I mean I don't know if she's a pit bull or not. She's she's the sweetest dog in the world, but. 
Well, I don't know. That I mean, our insurance don't allow them. I mean, we we allow pets, um, uh, but pit bulls are on the on the non-insurable list. So, um, I mean, they do have that pet screening. If it is an emotional support animal or whatever, that you can go through pet screening, and if they have that ID number, you can get them get them lined out. But if they don't, then it's a uh, you know it's an insurance issue yeah okay i mean how can you determine that she's uh, uh, like for sure a pit i mean she, <laughs> you know what i mean i mean she's kind of guy that looks like it in the head but i mean i don't know for sure you know oh i don't i don't that's not on me i just know that if you if you move in with a dog that looks like a pit the next thing you know right. the neighbors are going to get upset and then after that um, they're going to evict you so it don't do nobody no good to to go through the you know what i mean but if, but if you but if you didn't have the animal then it would be all 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 good you know what i mean and if it wasn't a a, a a apartment and it was a house you know it might be a different story because you ain't got no neighbors you know what i mean but being apartments um everybody's got to kind of be the same Available? No, sir. Not not there. We don't. Okay. Yeah. All right. So. Yeah, kind, of, kind of what I was kind of looking for. Really, too. I really didn't know if I want to do an apartment or not. But. Well, if we run across anything, we'll let you know. Okay. All right. I appreciate it. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Beth. Hello. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. Are you looking to rent an apartment for us and from us in Comanche? Uh, no, not anymore. Well, what happened? Uh, I, found, I found one in Stephenville. You found one in Stephenville? That's where all the crackheads live. <laughs> yeah. Well, when I went when I went looking for Stephenville stuff or in Comanche, no one got back to me, so I, I only had like. Two more weeks to move out and how to do something fast. No one got back to you. What's your number? Uh, this number. Yeah. All right. I'll write it. Was, it was like four months ago. Four months ago and nobody called you back. No. Damn um, the I luck. Checked, I, I checked like three apartments down there. So you looked at three apartments and nobody called you back. Nope. None of them. I uh, went to the one that they just built. Right yeah. by the like wanted or something like that, and uh, they never answered me. And then the and then the did you go to ours and Bull Run or or uh, Mary Street or no? Um, I, I believe so. Okay. Uh, although I I know I checked one out, but it was just it wasn't right for me and my wife and my kid. I got you. Well. I appreciate your time, sir. Sir, thank you.
Hello? Hello? Yes, ma'am. Are you looking to rent an apartment from us in Comanche? No, sir, I was not. What about Hamilton? I was looking at Hamilton, but I have to wait until November or December. Well, what's going on then? Uh, I will have the money to do it. Holy shit. I need some money in November and December. Can I set an appointment for you to go by and look at it? Is it the apartment? Okay, I, my husband and I both have a background, so it just depends on, for an apartment, I'd have to be able to pass a background check. What kind of background? Y'all been out murdering people? No. Well, then you should be all right. Y'all beat on each other? No. Molest kids? We don't have kids. Well, they don't got to be your kid. No. Okay, well, then you should be all right. So if I, it's uh it's on Reagan Street. I don't have it sitting in front of me. Uh, hold on, right quick. I will I will get the address maybe. Ugh. And also, I'm in Hope House right now, so I'll just have to find out when I can set up that appointment. Yeah, it's a uh, thirteen one thirteen South Reagan, Hamilton, Texas. South Reagan. Yes. So, what's your name? Courtney. Okay. Court What's your last name? And can I give you Greenfield? Okay. Can I give you a different number to call me on? Because this is actually the Hope House phone, and I have my own phone now. Yeah, absolutely. Do you have an email? No. No email. Damn. What's your phone number? Eight one seven two four three four zero nine one. Okay. What's your name? My name is Corey Thompson. Corey Thompson? Yep. All right. Um, I'll save this number in my phone, and I'll give you a call back when I'm able to come look at it. Okay. Okay. Sounds good to me. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Bye. So if I don't know if I can go back, I can hit send send a showing invitation, and the one she's interested in, and hit send invitation, and that's it. If she accepts the invitation. She'll put it on her own calendar, set up her own everything. Easy money. We are in leasing and then guest cards. So I click on guest cards, got a new guest, and that's where I'm at. Hello? Yeah. Are you looking to rent an apartment from us in Comanche, Texas? Um, no. Dang. I got your number. Looks like uh, looks like at one point you might have been. What about Hamilton, Texas? Um, no. Damn. So do you know anybody that might be? We're paying $100 to anybody that refers us a tenant. Uh, not at the moment. Okay. 
Well, thank you for your time. She, she sounds like Cracky Chan anyways. Can you go argue at the other end of the office? Hello? 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 Yes. Are you looking to rent an apartment from us in Comanche, Texas? Uh, I was calling for a friend. Calling for a friend? Yeah, and I think she's already looked at those. What'd she think about them? Uh, is it the ones on Mary Street? Yes, ma'am. Yeah, um, she, I, th I don't think she liked the location. What's the matter with the location? It's right next to the sheriff's office. She got a she <laughs> she got warrants. I got warrants. They don't ever bother me. Yeah, I, I, I don't I don't know what really what it was, but anyway, she said she had a uh, look at those. So well, we got some more. Wasn't big enough or what? We got we got some bigger ones over by the uh, high school. Are they houses? No, they're they're it's it's apartments. Oh, I see. It's like an older community over there, though, you know. I'm sorry. It's kind of an older community over there. Yeah. They'd be growing tomatoes and stuff outside, and I think one dude's growing weed, but you didn't hear it from me. <laughs> no, I'm playing. <laughs> yeah. Well, I, I, I mean, I'll tell her. And, uh, anyway, she's, you know, she's still looking, so I, I appreciate your call. Do, do you have her name? Can I get her name at least and phone number so I can call her? Let me, I, I would want to do that. Okay. I'll tell her. Well, uh, we're we're paying a hundred dollar referral to anybody that brings us a tenant. So if you talk her into it, that's a hundred bucks for you. Uh, okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Yes? 
Yes, are you looking to rent an apartment from us in Comanche, Texas? They done hung up on me, man. Just gonna keep hammering away, Jake. They gonna gonna call them till they buy or die. They're gonna be in the buy sell trade groups out there saying, "Would y'all please rent these apartments from these people?" So they'll quit calling me. Alexis, have you sent out any emails for rentals lately? Send out about 22 emails today. Like 22 of the same email with a different subject line. See if we can get 7,000 people to unsubscribe from our email list. Do what? Hello. Hello. Yes. Are you looking to rent an apartment from us in Comanche, Texas? Uh, no, I don't. I don't need one no more. I already got one. You got one. Why didn't you rent yeah. from us? Because I got a house instead. Got a house. Yes, sir. Damn, you got to mow your own grass, pay your own water at a house. Yes, sir. Damn, I wish I was rich like you. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, well, uh, also, if you know somebody looking to rent, we're paying a $100 finder's fee. She hung up. Jake, I forgot. I got to talking about being rich. Mm, mm, mm. Jesus. Hello? Hello? Yes, ma'am. Are you looking to rent an apartment from us in Comanche, Texas? I did. I, but the, you all sent me the information for Hamilton. Do what? Oh. So I wasn't interested in Hamilton. I was interested in Comanche. Well, what's your name? But from my understanding is y'all have the same property on Mary Street. We got all kinds of properties. Yeah, that was a little run down. Mary Street? Yeah. We just put brand new windows in, brand new air conditioners in, know, brand new floor windows, and paint. But, but, but it, it smelled and the walls were dirty and what I know the, the kitchen and the bathroom had new flooring, but the rest of it didn't. It just, I don't know. I got my grandkid and my son and my daughter. I don't even, moving which one did you look at? The one on Mary Street. The, uh, there's five 12. apartments. Unit 12 is already rented. So somebody else, somebody else rented Unit 12. We got. Okay, that's the one we saw. Yeah, unit fifteen is is the one you need to go look at. Is it any is it any better? I mean, unit twelve, the lady used to cook tamales out of, so oh, it took okay. a lot to it clean did it not up. Smell like tamales. Do what? It did not smell like tamales. Shitting you, that's exactly what it smelled like. You cooked tamales mm -hmm. in there for forty seven years. Mm -hmm. so, um, I'm gonna look at unit fifteen. I'm, I'm supposed to go look at a house on. Sunday. 
Uh, and if, if you want to send me, it also looks like there's a, I don't know, if you want to send me different properties and command to, my son's moving here at the end of September. Okay. And I need to find him a place to live. Okay. What's and your name? He's got a, my name's Karina. How do I spell that? C-O-R-I-N-A. Okay. Last name? Brown. What's that? Brown? Brown. Oh, okay. Brown. Yeah. Uh, what's your email? Uh, Karina.brown at gmail.com. C-O-R-I-N-A mm -hmm. dot brown? Yes, sir. Okay. Phone number? You just called me on it. Yeah, no, but I don't have it pulled up. 325 four, or? 469 oh, four. Okay. And I'm going to put you down for Mary Street, number 15. I'm going to send you a, a invite to where you can set up your own appointment to go see it. Okay. Okay. And so I'm going to send you a showing invitation right now. It'll come email and you set up your, your own time um, to go look at it. And that'll be it. And then you can. Okay. Do you have any more properties in? They have to be in the city of Comanche. That yes, that's we have we have another one at Bull Run, but it's saying 15 in on the website, um, so I can't set you up an appointment on 15. But I tell you what, it's got the same lockbox and everything else. Um, I'm gonna set it up for a unit, um, for a different unit, but just go look at 15 while you're there. I'm gonna set it up for this okay. one bedroom, but. Just look at unit 15 while you're there okay. and see what you think about it. Okay. I'll go, I'll go back and look at it because my daughter-in-law and my son walked in and they were like, nope. <laughs> and then I walked in and I was like, okay. I mean, it was, just, I, it was still just like the walls were still a little dirty. They and, might not have been done with it. I don't, I mean, because I know we, we repainted that one. And they, they had to put a new AC in and then we had to go back in there and, and uh, put all new doors in. So, I mean, it, it wasn't, it sounds like it was still in the middle of the remodel to me, but. Well, even, even some of the flooring had some of the, like the, the flooring in the bathroom was redone, but in some of the other spaces, the tiles were loose, the, the square tiles. No, nah, that's where I want to have my grandkids. But, but they, 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 they took, they took that up. So that, that's definitely been redone because we redid three, 12 and 13. Got all new flooring. Uh, seven and eight are already leased. Fifteen is being made ready right now, so it's getting done right now. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's all the, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. Energy efficient windows, energy efficient AC. You won't have to yeah, mow your grass. Really, I was, I was really excited because it looks like you guys did a lot of stuff to it, <laughs> and the other stuff was mostly cosmetic. Right. Um, and then you know, again, there was it was just. It just smelled funny, and you know, it, it was it was not a good smell when we walked in. And so we quickly walked out again. Yeah, and, I, um, when when we got that one, um, I mean, it, like I said, we had to redo the cabinets. Had to take out all the inside of the cabinets. That lady was an older Mexican lady, and I think she cooked tamales in there for 472 years. That's what it looked like to me. That is too funny. So, um, but yeah, I'll go look at 15. Um, I don't know. I'll, I'll try to go down there today. I've got my grandson here with me. Okay. And I've got an ear infection, which just hurts, man. I can't believe I have an ear infection, but I'll go take a look at it. Go, yeah, go take a look at 15. Uh, just set up your appointment on there. It'll send you a, a number to call. And then when you dial that number, um, you know, they'll, they'll somebody will answer the phone and let you in. All right. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Bye bye. Fucking closer. Jake, closer. Just think about that.
Hello? Sí, bueno. Oh, no, habla español. You habla inglés? No. Son of a bitch. All right. Thank you. I don't know what to do next. I don't know how to. Jacob, you've gotten 61 calls for uh, your listing, sir. In the time I've been dialing this morning, Jamie's phone's rang seven times since I started dialing, sir. So, um, hello. Do what? Hello. Yes. Uh, are you looking to rent an apartment from us in Comanche? Comanche, where is that at? It's by uh, Brownwood. Mm, I think that's too far. I'm looking for an apartment, but not that far. <laughs> what about Hamilton, Texas? Where do you live right now? Yeah, I'm living in Dallas now, but I was. Uh, my family lives in Hamilton. Oh. So I was thinking about moving out there. You need to get to Hamilton as quick as possible. No Rona in Hamilton. <laughs> My aunt keeps telling me that too. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing but freedom out there. I know, and I love the country. It's a beautiful um, town. It really is. What, um, what is your cheapest and smallest apartment? Our cheapest and smallest apartment, we will have number eight. Um, it's a one bedroom, uh, one bath. Um, and it'll be around four ninety five a month, I believe, and zero dollar deposit to move in. I can do that. Okay. <laughs> I um uh, I get a fixed income on one disability because I have a messed up leg. So I just need to, and it would just be me. My family lives around there, they'll come visit. They don't they have their own places. Right. So um, is it downstairs? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. And it's got covered parking. Well, I'm not allowed to drive, so. <laughs> um, I'm not allowed to drive either. They took my license in 08, but I'm a criminal. I just keep going. I just thug yeah, out. I was too, but that's not why they took my license. So. <laughs> Damn. How are you a criminal when you own all these houses? I Because I ain't got no driver's license, but I drive every day. They're like, <laughs> like catch me if you can. Oh, okay. Well, I live in Dallas right now, but it's just so expensive out here. I know. And then they won't let you do anything. You got Rona. People out there trying yeah. to trying to march around and tear shit up. Hell with that. <laughs> okay, so what do I need to do? Well, what's your first name? Marquita. M-A-R-Q-U-T-T-I-E. Okay. And Young is my last Young is my last name. You sound young. Oh, bless your heart. <laughs> what's your what's your email? Uh, K A S O N Y O U N G five nine at gmail dot com. I've got K A S O N Y O U N G five nine at gmail dot com. Yes, sir. Awesome. What's your phone number? You just called me. I know, but I don't have it pulled up. So okay. I gotta I gotta do this so I can set you so you can go on and, and set your own appointment to see it. Uh, we're gonna have to put it on the website right quick, uh, unit eight in um in in Hamilton. We're the kids moving out that lives there. Um, you know, it won't be ready till about middle of the month, but it don't sound like you're in a big hurry anyways. No, I'm just staying with my. I was just in the hospital for seven weeks, and I'm staying with my sister right now. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. What, Rona? No, why does everybody say that? So I don't know. I just. No. <laughs> it was because of my leg, and I had to go to rehab and stuff. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> what? Thank what? You. What's your phone number? Nine seven two seven four eight three eight seven nine. Okay, so I'm going to set you an appointment to look at uh, unit one there because it's the only one I'll be able to do because that kid still lives there. But just go set your appointment. It's going to send you a phone number to call, okay? 
and we just got done remodeling these so this is a this is a good unit um it's going to give you a number to call uh so set your appointment if it's next week next tuesday whatever it is um set your appointment and then we'll get you in there we'll we'll drive out there and let you in and all that okay this is the only thing if i'm not able to make it could my cousin go look at it for me absolutely i trust you and then he'll just take pictures and send it to me absolutely because honestly to tell you the truth i probably won't be able to make it out there until i'm moving in well yeah we'll 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 absolutely let them look at them for you. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to send a showing invitation right now. Um, and anyways, it's going to be for unit one there, but you'll be looking at unit unit uh, eight. So just write that down somewhere um, because I can't send you to unit eight right now because we got that right. kid still living there. But um, anyways, yeah. so I just sent it to you. Schedule your time for your cousin. And and we'll see it come in, and we'll reach out to them, and we'll make sure somebody's there to show it to them. Okay, I have another question to ask you real quick. Go ahead. I don't know if this will be a problem. Um, I wasn't playing about being a criminal thing, but it was a long, long time ago, like in 2006, long time ago. I do have things on my record from when I was young. What what are they? Violent violent criminal history or anything like that? Depends on who you ask. Well, no, I mean, is it is it a felony? It, it was dropped down to where it, it's not a felony. Well, if it's not a felony, then we don't have any problems. What if one of them that is a felony? Well, it, it, is it a violent felony? Okay, can I just tell you the real quick rundown? Yeah. Um, it was, but he got dropped. It was. Um, Manufacturing delivery enhanced to manslaughter. Um, someone had a cocaine drug overdose and died in my arms. When the police got there, I wouldn't tell them who gave him the drugs, so they charged me with it. I don't think that's but a problem because normally it's that, that's not that's not a violent um, hi history. You know what I mean? What right. what what they don't want people up. It's just bad juju if you got people over there fighting and all that kind of stuff. You know what I mean? Oh, no, I'm too old for all that, honey. So, I'm in my forties. <laughs> yeah. So, so this is uh, yeah, this is I don't I don't believe that'll be a problem, but um, you know, typically as long as you're not a pedophile and as long as you hadn't been, you know, robbing and sticking people up, then it's not it's not a um, not a problem. Okay. Yeah, I don't have nothing to worry about. So, okay. All right, we are just send the paperwork over and I'll look at it and fill it out. Okay, I sent it over. All right. All right, thank you so much. Thank you. Bye. Bye. That's it. We're shit out of leads, Jake. 